Welcome on in lesson three. So first of all, let's revise something about the previous lesson. In the previous lesson, I told you how we can save our project and about HR and BR. HR I used to make lines like this one and horizontal line and we are are used to break lines to start another line in just one line like this now coming on to this lesson today we are going to learn about how to make our text bold italics or underline them let's start with bold to do bold you can write two things bold tags are not empty tags and have a closing these are container tags it's like this if i want to make hypertext markup language bold I can write this and save it with the shortcut of control S. Here, I can save it like this by going on file and doing save or save as. I can do it like save as. I've already saved it like this, my website.html, so it's coming like this. But on those, I have not saved it, it'll come like this. .txt. Need to remove this and write the name you need to. Remember one thing. HTML needs to be written .html without any space. Without this, this will not be an HTML document and it won't work. And so I'm going to save it. I already had this document, so that's why it's asking for replace. And now I've already opened my document and I'm going to reload it. You might be able to see that it's gone bold. Now there are two ways to write in bold. First, we can write with this B. Another, you can write strong, like making the text strong. I'm going to save it with the shortcut Control S and reload the page. And yes, it's bold. Now, to make italics, so let's make, thank you for watching this video in italics. In italics, there are also two ways of writing it. In this, you can write I or E, M. These are also container tags. That means they have an opening and a closing. I write like this and close it like this. I save it with shortcut control S and reload this page. It turns italics. That means we have done it correctly. Now going forward, if I don't want to write I, I write in another method. As I told you, you can write E M M. Now let's not write it over here as it's already italics. I want to make animations italics. So I'll write E M and close it or here and save it with the shortcut and reload the page animations has turned italics 
and this has also remained italics. You can also de do italics and bolds on one word, like on the same text. So I'll write B or strong and close it up and save it with a shortcut and reload the page. Now, you might be able to see that this text is italics and as well bold. Now continuing with it. I want this animations underline too, adding animations on animations. To underline a text, you can write U. So I want to underline this, I'll write U. And this, as I told in the beginning, is also a container tag having an opening and a closing. I'm saving it with the shortcut, reloading the page, and it has an underline, bold, and italics, all one animation. Thank you all for watching this video. I hope you liked it. And don't miss to subscribe our channel for latest lessons. Thank you. You can also watch this in Hindi. The link is given in the description box.